Hello watch fans and welcome to another watch review video. Um, tonight's video we're going to be taking a look at this Alpina Avalanche. Um, a little bit about Alpina for those of you who do not know. Uh, they are a watch company that's been around for a long time. They were started in 1883, um, all Swiss made, um, but they just make some really beautiful timepieces. Like I said, this one here is the Avalanche. Um, beautiful, beautiful watch. One of my favorite watches in my collection as of right now, probably number one. Um, this is probably my, my favorite at this point. Um, the watch did come um, with a different strap. Uh, it does come when you buy it stock from the factory with these poly straps. Uh, nothing wrong with the poly straps. They were very nice. Nice soft polyurethane. Well made. Had the logo on there. Just thought the watch could use a little bit of a kick for how nice it was. So after talking to a few people, um, hopped on eBay and found this uh, alligator strap for the watch. It is an Alpina factory strap. Um, you have the Alpina logo on the inside is genuine alligator very very comfortable um just thought it really uh made the watch pop a little bit the watch is all 316l stainless steel of course they do use a sapphire crystal it is an automatic um alpina does use um some in-house movements this is based on the um etta 2824 movement uh, again, very, very smooth, wonderful movement. I find myself uh, staring at it a lot during the day and really, really um, have had a lot of, lot of enjoyment out of this watch. Alpina was a brand that I had seen um, in magazines and seen online and really just kind of fell in love with the look. A nice, thin profile. The watch doesn't weigh very much. Um, Really have to thank my friend Tim. Um, I, I did buy it used from him, but it, again, in mint, mint condition. Price point, um, these things are all over the board. I've seen them online anywhere from a thousand dollars to fifteen hundred dollars, but worth every penny. If you can find one pre owned that's in this kind of shape, I would jump on it in a heartbeat. Uh, the watch is 48 millimeters. Again, do a quick wrist shot for you. Um, does wear every bit as big um, as a 48. A lot of their models uh, that I've looked at are smaller in that 44 to 45 range. Um, this was one of their bigger models, which really kind of drew me to it. But just gorgeous. I mean, the back, exhibition case back, Alpina logo on the, on the rotor. All jeweled on the inside. Um, they've just seemed to do do everything right with this watch. My only complaint with the watch was really the poly straps. And like I said, you know, nothing wrong with them. Just wasn't my cup of tea. I just felt this watch needed the leather straps. So, um... Again, if you're interested in this kind of a watch, Alpina is sold everywhere online. Uh, eBay, uh, World of Watches, Joma Shop, Ashford, uh, pretty much any of your main watch retailers um, seem to carry the Alpina brand. And um, if it's a brand you're not familiar with, you know, go online, do a little research, you know, look at some of the styles. Like I said, this is really one of their more oversized watches if you can call it that and um, they have a lot more you know classic styles a lot a lot of beautiful watches that Alpina makes and then once again just want to do um, a quick update we still are giving away the uh, Invicta Pro Diver uh, 10 year anniversary automatic watch when we hit 100 subscribers um, we're slowly climbing the ladder to that. I think when I started the contest, I want to say I had 29 subscribers. We're now at 42. So, again, if you know anybody who 
likes Invicta or would like to win a free watch or wants to help you win a free watch, just tell them to subscribe and it gets us one more spot closer to the uh, to the goal and they get to enjoy all these amazing watch videos. Um, next time, um, not really sure what watch that I would like to um, review next. So I'll, you know, I would like to take some um, some requests from the people who do watch my reviews regularly. If there is a um, a brand of watch out there or a watch that you've seen me wear on Instagram or talk about before and you'd like to see a video on it, uh, leave a comment. I am open to um, any suggestions. Um, I, I also have some other friends who uh, wanted to send in some watches for reviews. Again, I am open to anything. Just shoot me a DM on Instagram um, or an email or, again, leave a comment and um, we'll, we'll work something out. I would love to get as many different kinds of watches and brands out there to people so they can um, really see what's out there. So, also, any questions or comments on this watch, again, ask away, and I'm more than happy to um, answer them any way I can. I hope you guys have uh, enjoyed this watch. Um, I know I have. Top top of my of my list right now. This is by far my most favorite watch. Hope everybody has a great week. And um, again, leave your suggestions. And the next video will be coming up in a few days. Have a good one.